this is your time to just get out there and be yourself. Don't worry about what's happening outside of your game. You guys play your game, enjoy your game, have fun out there, and feel the rest. Got it? Perfect. Okay. For some, it's a pep talk. For others, it's silence as the biggest game of their lives lies ahead. And a game that can be memorable. It's all going to come down to the final end in a 3-3 tie. Final stone for Alberta and Thomas Scotton. The crowd seven. comes alive here in Fort McMurray. Well, what do you think? I think it's overcrowded with the, the upweight ability of Matt Dunstone. The men's final of the m and &M. Canadian Junior oh, comes yeah, down to a oh, final yeah, stone. Yeah, Manitoba's yeah, Matt yeah, Dunstone yeah, coming off his own. Yeah, and he'll get it for the win. Dunstone and Manitoba will win the m and &M Canadian Juniors. What a shot. Welcome to Liverpool, Nova Scotia, the south shore of Nova Scotia, about oh, 90 minutes or so from Halifax, and that is Coffin Island, the lighthouse of Coffin Island that sits just off the shore where the Mersey River, appropriately enough, meets the Atlantic. As on this Sunday, we say hello Canada and welcome to the Amera Centre and our coverage of the men's final here at the M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors Wrestle alongside. Yesterday it was Kelsey Rock of Alberta that won the women's final and so she will represent Canada at the World Juniors to be played in Flim, Switzerland at the end of February. And as in women's play, there were no tiebreakers. Three teams making it through to the playoffs. Manitoba getting to the bye to the final, leaving New Brunswick to play Alberta in the semi earlier today. Alberta's Carter Lautner out of the Glencoe in Calgary as he played Rene Como from Fredericton. New Brunswick led it 7-0 after four with steals in three and four. Alberta tried a small comeback. And then in the ninth, well, New Brunswick added one more to make it 9-4. And in the tenth, New Brunswick simply ran them out of stones. Make the final 9-4, a win for New Brunswick. And so now they are on to the final against a very impressive side, Manitoba, and skipped by Braden Calvert. And this Manitoba team knew as of Wednesday, they rattled off eight straight wins to clinch first place. They were that good. They really were. In fact, 9-1 overall, top of the heap. Great percentages, obviously playing great, but they nearly shut it down in all intents and purposes Wednesday after they clinched first place. They lost the one game. I can give them a bye for that. But can they crank it back up? There's got to be a bit of ring rust here. They've had three days off. On the other hand, you have New Brunswick, Rene Como, his team from Fredericton, Coming off the ice, well, just a matter of hours ago, looking very good in their win. No kidding. And if you knew you were going to win the semifinal, you really want to play the semifinal. They're coming off this morning's game hotter than a firecracker. They put so many rocks in play against Alberta. And they said after the game, that was the key to the victory, is getting some rocks in play, throwing Alberta off. That's exactly what you're going to see in this Manitoba game. So it is New Brunswick against Manitoba. Manitoba looking to make it back-to-back. -back. Men's junior wins when we come back to Liverpool. M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors are brought to you by M&M Meat Shops. Frozen food at its best. The M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors are brought to you by Capital One. What's in your wallet? By World Financial Group. Creating a better tomorrow for families today. WFG. And by Cashmere Bathroom Tissue. Nothing feels like cashmere. Rene Como trying to win New Brunswick's first junior men's title since Ryan Sherrard in 2004. Manitoba and Braden Calvert trying to win back-to-back -back after Matt Dunstone did it a year ago in Fort McMurray. Time to meet the teams now, and it's brought to you by Ford, a proud partner of the Canadian Curling Association for 20 years. 
Renee Como and his team come out of the Capital Winter Club in Fredericton, while the Manitoba champions, they curl out of the Deer Lodge Curling Club in Winnipeg, script by Braden Calvert. Manitoba finishing top of the table. They were best all week at 9-1, and one, and so they will have the last rock, and they will have the choice of stones, and they have elected to go with the yellow, and so New Brunswick will play the red, and to get us underway, New Brunswick Wait lead. Only. Over there. How good is that? Ryan Freeze. Top four. <laughs> yeah. You just know what's going to happen if the uh, Mine's a little tight. Manitoba shot gets in behind the yeah. T-line. That's what he'll be called to do is that freeze. He's had wonderful four. speed yeah. control all week. The whole team uh, has impressed me, Good. this uh, New Brunswick team. They're a little under the radar back there. They've only been together for such a short period of time. He's getting a workout already. They did knock off Matt Dunstone in that big spiel in Ottawa. That's probably the most prestigious junior event of the year. So they, uh, they had to play well yeah. in that event, and they've done it again this week. Normal. Yep. 19-year-old Brendan Wilson. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Normal. Hi, boy. Hi, boy. Interestingly enough, you know, I talked to Como, you and I did after the game this morning. And he said, look, we're we'll, we'll likely played a little open in the first, and we'll wait to uh, be aggressive with the last rock. But. Queen. Going back to what you said clean. about ring yeah. rust yeah. That's clean. on Manitoba, clean. Clean. if in fact that's the case, wouldn't you want to force them just a Good. little bit here in the first? Yeah, I, I think you're absolutely correct. It's it's uh, first of all, New Brunswick made a ton of finesse shots three or four hours ago, so they know the ice. The ice has gotten just a fraction, and ever so slightly straighter as the week's gone along. Manitoba might not pick up on that. They, the drawway was a little bit quicker this morning. There's a lot of things helping uh, New Brunswick here. Go right after them. That's a good idea. Oh, normal. No. Oh. Whoa. Shot. Sarah. Good. Sorry. Stop. Yeah, there, kind of. Five. Yeah. Manitoba 9-1, uh, and one, two games clear of everybody, but when you really look at the men's field, there were six teams as good as six and four, and you know what happens in a long round robin. For Wait instance, the Manitoba-New right Brunswick there. game ended up 6-4. Ended up yeah, well, last on. shot victory. If that so went the other way, both teams would have been 8-2, and, two, and oh, uh, the hammer would have gone to New Brunswick oh, in this situation. It was extremely close competition with the top six. Like top four. Good. Troll. You got it. Just control. Yep. All the way. Hard. Hard. That boy. So up and down the sheet here in this uh, first as we play the second stones. Your thoughts on a game plan? Well, similar to what you just mentioned, Vic, it's uh, the Como teams had the hot hand with an, an aggressive play. That's the, how they beat Alberta, and that's the only way they're going to beat this number one Manitoba team. For Manitoba, keep it open because the skipper is 6% better than the New Brunswick skip, so he needs to leave some room for himself to make those big shots. The game plan is brought to you by World Financial Group, helping families have better Nine. financial futures. We are at Queen's Place Emeritus Center. This facility opening back in December of 2011. Seats Touch just more. over a yep. thousand. Gotta go. There are fitness rooms, meeting rooms. Oh. It's become yeah. a center of activity yep. for yep. Liverpool. Oh boy. Hey, still. Got a boy. Straighter. Nine. Ten. Hear that comment, Vic? Uh, he, he, he just made that nice shot, turned to the front end, and said it's straighter. And that's exactly the difference that uh, they need to pick up on right away. And I think this is an advantage for Manitoba to throw them up and down and get the broom in the exact right spot before you start playing those oh. higher oh. degree of difficulty shots. You know, as Daniels from uh, Burnaby, BC, no, both never. these teams are first year and, uh, teams. Annie? And uh, yeah. the Como side was looking for a third. 
Uh, Como had known Kraft and Freeze's front end, but they made a call out west, you got it. asked one particular player to come, and they said, no, he said, no, I can't, I'm committed. But I think I know somebody, and uh, that's Daniel Wenzik. Control. And so now he's come east from Burnaby and attends you got it. UNB. But you see that really now so often in the game at the junior level now you're seeing it at women's level men's level look at all the, the players who've gone from Pull province up. to province oh. it's amazing and how far they travel to do Fair it control. it's it's incredible yep. the dedication of these uh, oh, these teams oh, oh. but that's the only way you're going to get to this level Curl. Shot. nice throw yeah. Yeah. nine Close. Daniel coming whoa, through yeah. the uh, Canada whoa, Games whoa, system, whoa, 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 whoa. having no, skipped no. British Columbia at a Canada Three. Winter Games in Halifax back in 2011. That's a similar type of pressure uh, arena conditions, uh, open air arena where there's the crowd noise. Yeah, if you've never played in an Maybe arena, it's, there's so many extra it. distractions that you you might not have prepared for her as you play in your curling club. Control! Control. Little yep. less. Touch less! Hard! Oh! Oh! Whoa! Clean. 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 Clean! 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 I like that the one. soft weight of this team. It's uh, so easy to control it. Nice throw! That's off. Out of work! This particular spot in the ice here, it's, it's, it doesn't run straight, but it's the straightest spot in the building. Just in that four-foot strip, is it? you can overthrow this and roll out pretty easily. Just a nine. Okay. Nine being hog to hog and trying to be accurate with hitting the broom, but also being accurate with the speed control. If he throws an eight, it gets there too soon, hasn't got time to curl. So Rene Como and his third, Daniel Wenzik, they make their yep. home in yep. Fredericton. That's clean, where they clean, also go to uh, school and work. And then Jordan clean, Kraft and Ryan Freeze, they are clean. in uh, St. John. So there's some commitment there as well, as we often see at other levels. Your team may only come together for weekend bond spiels. So you have to yeah. have it planned out. I'm going to commit. I'm going to go to the, the curling club, practice on my own, go huh? through the drills. A little bit to that. My hair, probably through that little down from a nine. That's okay. Yeah. Our first look at Braden Calvert, a former Bring Manitoba high school yeah, champion. Oh, 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 oh. He won the... Clean, clean. Please. High school championship out of Carberry. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Hi, right, boy. Good throw. Nice throw. That was good control, mate. Three flat foot deliveries on this Manitoba team, Vic. That's a that's a, a rarity. <laughs> that's a record. <laughs> Same way. What's the matter with these people? <laughs> a little firm, eh? Just there. That's a sign of a good skip, and you the saw that uh, pretty straight. Yeah. Out of Rene too, saying like they both made they their shots, but, but you yeah. reconfirm with your in vice. You know, was I up a bit? Was I in out a bit? Just get a good feel for how you're actually releasing it. Nine. Nine. Stay close. Yep. Close. Yep. Clean. Yep. Yep. Hard. Hard. Yep. Hard. Straight yep. up. Yep. Hard. Hard. Craft and Freeze taking him all the way down. Throw feel. Just easy. Okay. Also feel. feel. Yeah. You got it. Touch less. They're taking noticeably less ice than they did to stay, and they have to hit it on the high side, so this will be humming. Most uh, flat foot curlers, when they 
throw with no backswing. It's a little bit of an in-out motion on the out turn. It's very readable. Yep. Yep. Should run pretty hard. straight. Yep. Hard. Hard, guys. Really hard, guys. Really hard. Hard out. Hard out. Jesus. Okay. Well, that's a missed opportunity and an early mistake from Braden Calvert, Manitoba, looking for the blank. Forced to eat one. Moose Harbor here in Liverpool. The NHL on TSN continues on Tuesday. It's a doubleheader. First up, the Lightning are in Toronto facing the Leafs. Lightning of one three in a row. Leafs coming off an overtime loss to Winnipeg. Blackhawks are in Calgary. It all begins 7 Eastern, 4 Pacific here on TSN. And from Moose Harbor, where it has turned cold again here yes. in, uh, on the south shore of Nova Scotia. Got above freezing yesterday. There was uh, some light rain, but snow flurries this morning when we were making our way to the arena. And Manitoba, a little mistake uh, nice by Braden tight. Calvert with his last. Didn't get the blank, so he forced to take the single. And it'll be yeah. New Brunswick that now has the last rock here in this second playing the Redstones. Yeah, Braden loved that one back. He took really tight ice. I just assumed if he'd float it out a little bit, he probably just... Threw it square, curled an inch, and uh, but they, that's the professional miss. You don't want to whiff right by it and be down one. Line's getting better. But you remember that little Line's conversation okay. that he oh, had? Oh, it's got to He's pretty good. I was lying With his uh, third oh, Kyle Kurz. Well, on the rock. Talking right. about, was yep. it a little firm? Yep. Was it this, you know, and... Uh, hard yeah, 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 hard. Yeah. Whether, in fact, it hard. resulted in hard. that, I'm don't not stop. sure. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Hard. Straight up. Hard. Trying to cover it. As Manitoba came in, sits like top button, and up went that yeah. corner covering the edge of the eight from New Brunswick. Great brushing judgment there from the Manitoba front end. and Didn't quite curl enough, but they swept it as close to that top 12 as they could. Obviously, in the rings, it can be hit. Close. Yes. Yes. Really hard. Hard. Go, 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 go. Keep her going. Keep her going. Brian Freeze. I heard Woe, too. It's pretty close. About half. So the stone goes yeah. back. As he crashed out in front. Could be a little. Yeah. That last shot that wrecked it over curled and down the center. Nobody practices very, very rarely down the center of the sheet. So there's a little bit of fresh pebble. Therefore, maximum curl in the first couple of ends till those spots get worn down a little bit. About halfway. Look at Vandenbosch. It's halfway low then. Doesn't look like at all. Got a curl. Second appearance. Halfway. Just tight, tight, no tight. tight. And the Canadian juniors back in. 2012, you he won a bronze medal as he Where played lead for Kyle line. Deering. That uh, event was in yep. Napanee. Yep. Hard! Hard! Very a bit hard. I know that Good. they rarely play in practice like takeout weight because that's just Feel. assumed it's mm -hmm. going to be straight. But I, well, that's one thing I don't understand. Why? I thought at one time everybody was designated to play a certain part of the ice. Yep. Yeah, that's, yep. a, that's yep. a good point, Vic. And teams have got away from that because of the uh, draw to the button for hammer. And in this case, it was already decided because the Manitoba with the better record. But you're right. People are into that habit of racing to the button and practice and getting used to those lanes and speeding them up. And uh, that's exactly what should happen. Every curler throws a different spot. Uh, in my team, they... The skip and the lead curved one turn each to the center line, and the uh, second and the vice went in the other direction. So you map the whole sheet. Jordan Kraft makes the double. Shooter rolls over to cover the other side of the eight foot. You gotta go. Line's good. Right out of his We're hand. You heard somebody say, you gotta go. Okay, and so can. Kurz and halfway. Wilson pick him up. Over center. Shot stone still belongs oh. to Manitoba. Yeah, Just off right, center line, yeah. top yeah, of the go button. Ahead, then. Hard, hard, get it past center, hard, get it over, hard, a little more, hard, hard, hard guys, a little more. Oh boy, that's, he covers a corner maybe, 
It's a really good looking end for both teams here, Vic. In the case of Manitoba, it's hard to outdraw that yellow one, and we've got a pretty good guard on it. But for uh, New Brunswick, two nice corner guards that are easily raised. Play it tight. Wait, kid. No. Close. Firm, maybe. No. Yep. Hard. Hard. Fresh pebble again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch it off this. Okay. And that little rub. Not enough to uh, okay. stop it, and it'll spill out in the back. Let that curl a little more, get more of the guard. It would have hit the red and redirected into the rings. But uh, the, again, Smart error. Everybody's going to miss the you know, 10, 15 percent every game. You might as well miss them the right way. I'll be tight on rock. He got it. Almost exactly four feet for this guard. That's just incredible ice. The rocks are using this week have the blue hone inserts that are extremely hard granite. Halfway. They Four. tend to straighten out, so by time to time they have to condition the rocks a little bit. And running. Jamie Barasa and his team, as usual. Yeah, tight. It's definitely tight. Perfect yep. sheet, really. There's no tricks to this sheet at all. Yeah, 12. Yeah, we're almost in. Whoa. Although I, th I think I just heard a Braden Calvert Whoa. 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 Sit. 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 when Kyle Kurz was okay. saying, is Sorry about that. Th that the same? I said, no, it's tightened. It, it's just a little straighter. Yeah. It goes back to what uh, you said okay, earlier, right? right? I missed that, Vic. Thanks. That's exactly it. And you, uh, you have to have a short memory as a skip in some cases. Uh, some, you know, if you're out in a spot you haven't played, you try to go back in the memory bank and see if you played it Tuesday night or something. But in this case, it's a hair straighter than when Manitoba was in their run of 8 0. So they have to be careful here not to uh, nope. read too much into it. Believe what you see. Come on. Watch the roll. Get the roll. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. I know all about that short memory. <laughs> what? When, didn't I pay last time? No, you that's didn't a, pay last right. time, Russ. Uh, it's your turn. Really? I didn't pay? No, you didn't Can't pay, believe. Russ. Are you sure? Yes, I'm really sure. You seem to forget quite quickly. I pause. I bought that water for you. <laughs> yep. yep. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Curl, curl, curl. Ah, try it. Try it. So 14 teams no began play last weekend, and then they were divided into two pools, a championship pool and a seeding pool. This was the championship pool. Manitoba, Manitoba by the time Wednesday finished, they were 8-0, and oh, and that was already enough. Everyone else was three games back, and so they were yep. through and clear. Yep. And then the edge Hard. came off, as Russ mentioned, Hard. and they dropped one of two really hard. the rest of the way let it go right up hard right to it hard go 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 and then the six remaining teams played in a seating pool and this of course all leading up to how the teams will be grouped next year in corner brook and uh, yukon had a good showing at five and four and it's all about bringing the the territories, separating them now, so that there are in fact the uh, ten provinces, as well as northern Ontario, and then the three territories. And a slight miss by Manitoba. The run back was missed by a fraction. It was missed on the high side, and that seems to be the tend trend here for Manitoba. Other way. Hair straighter oh. ice. Yep. Oh. Yep. Hard. Same thing again, okay, under, under curled, and that, that, that's what I guessed might happen. So, Braden's going to have to figure that out pretty quick. Back eight. Yeah. We're through it a bit. That's good. I talked about earlier when uh, Manitoba had one buried, I said it's a good situation for both teams because they had two corner guards yeah, at the time, yeah. both Cross of them nice the and page. close. And the reason for that is now they can actually tap this back, roll in, and if it's made perfect, yeah, yeah, there could be one here under cover, but more importantly, three in the rings. 85, really? 
Or split, right? Oh, yeah, a well, huge shot going. here late in the end. Back one, or back eight, T line. Oh, it didn't actually my mine didn't need to come up very much. 90. For the straight back? Yeah. Right, a couple inches. Sweeping into that much. Yeah. Rene Como, who earlier. this year yeah, yeah. skips Early, yep. the New Brunswick champions. Yep. Last year he Hard. was in Fort McMurray and it's played okay. third for Hard. Josh yep. Berry. Yep. And they went Hard. six and four. Hard. Freeze and crap. Trying to hold Hard. this now, Hard. just to get your corner, bump it in, and. That's it, I think. Oh, that's well, I'm not sure. You see a lot of white, but those two stones now are grouped on the button. Thanks, so. Right there. That's touch and go for three. Any thicker, and he's got the three in and wouldn't have set up this double. Would you, could you question the turn played at that? Yeah, no, for sure. Um, I liked it because it's probably the straighter the two turns out that wide, but uh, it wasn't a tough shot either way. But I, I like the, uh, your way, Vic, uh, because he would have had a stone. Yeah, and you would have had a little more uh, roll with their thrown rock. Either way was makeable, and it's the shot you know. You, Rene might have played that in practice. Tricky double. You can't hit a ton yep. of the first one. You have to get it pretty thin. A oh. little bit of an out here. Close. Oh. For Braden Calvert in Manitoba yep. to the Deer Lodge in Winnipeg. Bang, bang. No, he'll sit there. And now, is it a hit for three? That was an awful throw. Okay, so he's a little off. He forced to take one. Calvert in the first, looking for the blank. He wasn't happy with his first throw. He wasn't happy with that throw. Is that, in effect, what we talked about? Maybe just we'll those three days. Yep. I, I agree. Absolutely. No question. And and it's a shade straighter. And every error we've seen so far out of Manitoba has been on the high side. They're going to have to tighten that ice up a little bit. I came really tight, too. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Final stone here in yep, two. Hard, hard. Rene Como, New Brunswick. Yep, right up, hard. Craft and freeze on the brush. Right up. Yep, yep, Wensick yep, yep. calling line. Bang it on the nose, and there's a certain two. And now they'll take a look. And they've asked for the stick. They will. They've called for the official to uh, to bring out the stick. And they'll run that around the rings. It's extremely close. The sheet's long from the from, from, the the chair? from that side. Really I know. I from that side looks in. From the over top, it doesn't. Yeah. How often? I mean, they, well, Jamie Barassa, the, 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 the good ice makers are rarely wrong with their their paint but how often does that happen do you think well quite a bit because it's it's easy to drill the hole slightly yep. off center two it is for new brunswick an early lead over a manitoba side that just appears to be a little off Let's flash back to just a year ago when we were in Fort McMurray for the Canadian Juniors. And remember the final end, Manitoba's Matt Dunstone facing two Alberta Rocks. Throws that up. Wait, bang, bang. There they go. Sits with the one to win the Canadian Junior Championship. 4-3, the final. Dunstone and the team would go on to win a bronze medal at the World Juniors in Sochi. As we welcome you back, and there is the uh, name of Matthew Gunstone. And he's been a big part of this team of uh, Braden Calvert as we welcome you back to Liverpool. The Amera Center, 2-1 New Brunswick. Manitoba will have the last rock. 
playing the Yellowstones here in three. Calvert beating Dunstone in the Manitoba Where? final on the uh, on three straight yeah, steals to help them pull away. Well, if you can. But yeah, they are close friends. Dunstone has helped him, given this him some ideas of what to expect Stand when in. he got here to Liverpool, how to approach Only this to. very okay. large field yep. of 14. And in fact, Hard, they have right been up. communicating go, go, go. over the Hard, course of the last go, go, week. Go, go, so uh, Matt's been Hard, very much involved here. That's pretty classy, you know, when you lose the final and you... Uh, you shake hands and you cheer on your uh, your province. That's what curling's all about. That's Back what makes line. it so, such a wonderful Good. sport. And Matt's just, a, he gets it. You know, Matt really does get it. And uh, what a great run he had last year. What a shot that was to win. Yep, 73. Hack, hard, hack, hard. Hard, guys. Whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, close. Brendan Wilson yep. close. Yep. throwing the lead stones. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yep. Hard roll, hard roll, hard roll. Both these teams built in a similar fashion. You know, players coming from across the country, as Daniel Wenzik did for New Brunswick. Wilson only joined the Calvert team three weeks before the Provincials in December. Incredible. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Just scared that top one. Not leaving it in a wonderful spot either because it blocks off at this point in time the out turn guard of the button. Just over curled a tad. Halfway. Yeah, I yeah. should know this way. You got it. It's the first really, really good shot that Manitoba's made with that soft weight. Oak turn, come around, tap, and roll underneath. Last over, there. halfway, maybe. Where? Nope. Halfway, little push. Halfway. Little push. Well, well, I got halfway. Lucas Vanden Bosch. Tight, maybe. Tight. No. No, half, halfway tight. Really got to finish it. No, that's it. heavy. It's tight. All these young teams uh, yeah, now yeah, throw this tight. type really of rotation, tight. Vic, and it's, that's the way you have to throw a curling foot. rock. It's so we easy want, to read. It'll yep, glide yep, that extra foot or two, which in this case is a bad idea. It's going to set up a double. Not bad. If you only throw a one, one and a quarter, one and a half rotation, the rock will plow after a while. Once it gets to the far eight. hog line, right. as it loses speed, it's also losing rotation. And with the lack of rotation, you, you get way too much friction. Yep. Hard. 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 Really hard. Missed hard. the run back. Going to get the double. Bang, bang. And around, and then it'll spill out into the open. Sitting on the... Edge of the eight. Could have played that with a little softer weight. Ideally, to, you want to make the enemy rocks go away, but it was more important with the Control. advantage of uh, rolling in behind that guard would have been really nice and forcing uh, Manitoba here. Control a little firm. Yep. Oh, yep, yep. Hard. Hard. Right up, guys. Really hard. No roll, no roll. Oh. Yep. I'm just gonna group them again. Uh, Pretty good. Rolls over Fine. on top. That really, took off. That really took off. Okay. Nine. I think they called for a nose here, Vic, which is okay if you're perfect. Then you're right on top of the uh, Manitoba yep. rock, but anything inside outside is going to uh, leave yep, uh, Manitoba yeah, with a chance hard. to sit deuce. Really hard! Hard, right up. Hard! Right up. Daniel Wenzing. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at that roll. Now, oh, maybe just again, if it stops a rock short, it's right in behind. Okay. You have a half? Manitoba with last rock here in uh, the third. Okay, hair less than half. Uh, hack. Hit. Nice weight choice, just hacks. If you do hit half of it, it's enough to punch it at least to the back 12. You don't necessarily have to get it out. You want to sit two. For hack? For hack? Throw an 85. Yeah. Okay. You got it. A little tighter spot than the hit and roll that really curled here.
Whoa, Close. more than hack. Whoa. Hack bomb. Whoa. Oh. Almost bomb. No, right off. Peace? Not curling at all. Right off. Peace? More than hack weight, big rotation. That's not going to finish. Go, 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 go. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Kyle Kurz. Oh, wait. 80. So Rene Como finishes at 7 and 3, second place. He beats Alberta, then beats Alberta again in this morning's semifinal. But you see that he lost against Manitoba when they played in round robin. Case of the yep. wide, uh, yep. 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 wide Whoa. mistakes Whoa. here Whoa. for Manitoba, Vic. You Whoa. have to hang around Whoa. on those. No. Sit. Sit. Okay. Daniel Wenzek. Well, as you can see, you win eight in a row. By the time they knocked off Alberta, that was enough for first place. And then they dropped one to BC and one over Nova Scotia 8 2. But it was good enough to put them into the final. And here they are, down by one. Manitoba out of the Deer Lodge in Winnipeg. Just control. Yep. Really hard. Yes. Hard. Hard. Oh. Yep. Oh. Hard. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Hard roll. Go, go, go. Hard. Go, 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 go. My fault. Just a boat. Ready? Yep. Kind of late. Board. Roll your way. Just seems to this point when you look at. Uh, Braden Calvert and Rene Como. The shot selection in favor of New Brunswick, just maybe a little bit softer. Uh, Manitoba appears to be wanting to th overthrow mm -hmm. things exactly. a little bit. Yep. Yeah, and it has to be. Uh, you know, you you shouldn't be playing today if you don't have some adrenaline, Lord, extra yeah. adrenaline running through. But you're right, Vic. I think that no, is the no, difference no, here. No. Uh, Rene Como has made a ton clean, of soft shots clean, during the clean, week. Clean, Here's another clean, one. Yep, See how it's yep, slow, yep, yep, slow hard, speed. Hard, Looks like whoa, it's going to hang, and then it comes whoa, because whoa. of that proper speed. Well, it was an interesting comment made to me uh, earlier today. I think the yeah. if there is a pressure here, it is on Manitoba Control? because they've been yeah. the best all week. You got it. But yeah. Rene Como said, "This is." We're here and we're playing on house money. <laughs> and I thought that was wonderful. I mean, we could be in a, we could be back in Vegas, <laughs> but they really feel that they're here. This is, in for all intents and purposes, a win for them just to get here. That's a, what a wonderful attitude, and you have to think that way. If you know, if they happen to lose this game, they're the second best team in the country. They've they've represented their province well, their families well, their teammates well, and uh, other competitors they've beaten along the way. And uh, you you can't. It's Put all the eggs in that one basket, oh, and, and we tend to do that, don't we, for these big championships? Oh, a lot of weight. No. Close. No. no. Got it. And he'll okay. Okay. hang around, Thanks. which Here's is it. a key for them. That was one of the things that their coach, Tom Clasper, was Try saying when he came down to talk to me. Fellas, we have to hang around. Yeah. We can't yeah, exactly. give them that. Yeah. Free Thank shot. You. That freebie. That's that's a stat I think we need to keep because giving a, a top team on swingy ice a freebie is uh, you, you have no chance of winning. If you keep doing that enough. That was a little overthrown again. You heard the front end say that, but he's getting closer and uh, he'll figure it out for sure. Yeah, Wonderful technique. Again. Great delivery. You'd love to roll buried here, but don't be a hero. You cannot hit that guard. Hit sitting, just simply sitting two. You've accomplished what you set out to do at the start of the end, which is a force. Soft time. Close. No. Rim. No. No. Rim. No. No. Oh. no. 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 Oh. Right off. No. We're almost in nose. That's good. That's fine.
all on its own. Rene Como and New Brunswick are sitting the two. So uh, another nice end here for New Brunswick as the force is on. You got it. A little less than what I had. Yeah. Like we'll stay on. close all the way. Yeah. I think it's a little soft, but let's... did move a lot at the end. Facing a couple with his last. Yep. Looking for the, the single here in three Hard. to tie. Oh, 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 queen, queen, oh. oh. Queen, 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 queen. Atta boy, good throw. Wheel. You know? you say, maybe it's coming around a little bit for Braden Calvert. He gets the single. We're all even through three. One yellow. One yellow. Well, next week she will be in Montreal for the Scotties, but earlier today, Heather Smith, a former Canadian junior champion out of 1991 from New Brunswick, along with her team, and uh, playing third, of course, Nova Scotia junior champion of 2004, Jill Mauser, now Jill Brothers, on the ice here in Liverpool, getting in some practice. Here is the field for the Scotties. Rachel Homan will be back to defend Heather Strong, Kim Dolan. Comes out of retirement, Heather Smith. Andrea Crawford, maybe the year of New Brunswick. And Allison Ross, back for a second year to represent Quebec. Allison Flaxey makes her first appearance. Chelsea Carey wins out of Winnipeg. Stephanie Lawton, Val Sweeting. Boy, she played so well. Kesa Van Osh, we saw her sister representing BC here. And Sarah Colton, out of the Yukon Northwest Territories, was also here in Liverpool. As we welcome you back on this Sunday, to the M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors. It's the men's like final from Amera Center here in Liverpool. Won by Manitoba in the third, ties it up. We're curl. even at Tight. two, and here We're in high. the fourth, Halfway. it Get will be curl. New Brunswick that Whoa. has the last rock. They have Sit the hammer out. playing the Red Stones. Sit. Whoa. Well, Manitoba didn't want to be forced to one, so they won't be Sorry. happy, but I think it was Sorry. a good stepping stone for them. Uh, Skipper made a couple nice hits, brought the weight down a little bit. They're, they're starting Stop to get in their ball. noggin that it's a hair straighter and they have to keep that weight down or they're not going to get that finish. It may have been the first stone thrown by Calvert where there was no discussion afterwards. Yes. Yep. Yes. It was just good. It was yep. perfect. That's it. Enough said. Let's where? move on. Yep. Hard. Keep going. The four. Really got to go. Really got to go. Hard line. Hard. Hard. Really go. Hard. Hey, you're by. You're by, wait only. Oh, yeah, just Freeze by. Yeah, 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 yeah. What else would you expect <laughs> from Ryan Freeze? But the perfect freeze. You, <laughs> you beat me to it, Vic. Yeah, well, you got it. <laughs> your memory's a little short. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Great shot. Yeah. I didn't think it was by. It was a good scrubbing hog line in there to get that by. Like to go a little, a little early. Remember a couple of years ago, we were trying to think of the great curly names, and immediately you think Mine's about a little tight. Yep. Peter Corner. Yep. Ah, right. Corner. Hard, exactly. hard, hard. Line's Line's hard. Tight. hard. Line only. Line's tight. Line's tight, guys. Gotta go. Hard, guys. Go. Hard. Talk about great leads. It was Peter Corner was certainly one of them. I, I had the pleasure to play with Pete for a long time, and. He made a ton of shots and never, never missed the wrong way. Yep. Yep. Should be if you can make this run back, you should be able to save the red New Brunswick shot in the rings. No, well, he just missed one. In an earlier end, bang, and we'll leave the raised stone just peeking out shot Brock though is at back eight now and it appears to be in the gap that belongs to Manitoba but because of that wonderful freeze from Mr. <laughs> freeze it wasn't going to go anywhere and it keeps it in the uh, danger it. zone and no choice for Braden to do something with this one he ha cannot ignore this rock it's in too good a spot you got it Just control. Yep. 
Oh, oh. Control, touch up. Oh, right off. Go yep, on. yep. Hard. Hard. Cut. Three. Oh, much better. Lucas Vandenbosch gets the roll over just to cover a corner of that stone. They're sitting three, though. There's Nine. that little outside biter here on the about 10 o'clock. Manitoba without last rock. That belongs to oh, right New off, Brunswick. Right yep. Yeah. Jordan yeah. Kraft. Hard! Okay. And he'll get one Kraft. And the lead Ryan Freeze have been playing together since they were about 12 years of age. That's very nice. Yeah. So this was, 15, the, this was the package deal. Yeah. Those two, as a Como was putting his mm. team together. I think a little light's okay. Like top yeah, freebie ball. here for uh, Manitoba. So your top, top of the eight foot would be perfect. Maybe biting the four. You got it. Nice chance to apply some pressure. Kyle Kurz. Two nine. Line only. That's top like eight. A lot. Top eight. To Running close. Running close. Okay. Top four. Take no, a look. Like Take a look. A little light. Top four. Light went off early. Top top eight. He's top trying for a little bit. Top, yeah, it's T. Oh. Wilson on the left. Van and Bosch on the right. Where do you want it? Someone's going. Fit. Just even. Fit. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Sorry about that. It's a different path. Not the spot he wanted it. Not only is there a double, that. but behind the line like doesn't that. really help him. Sure. Do you like just drawing? I, like I don't mind the, the draw. I like the double. Okay, let's play it. Okay, how aggressive Top is four. this? Very, very, very aggressive, especially for junior teams. That usually the, it's the men's teams that are a little more aggressive than the juniors, and this shows a sign of real confidence here. Because if it doesn't work out, if they can't create oh, a, a half shot, their uh, skipper's going to be drawn against three or four, and. Uh, Obviously it. feels he can make that shot or he wouldn't play this shot. Ten. Ten's not what they want to hear. No. If it's ten, it probably won't even curl enough to get to that back yellow. Oh, no. Sure. Sit. Okay, Dan. Yeah, it comes down. Probably would have ended up in the blue. Probably back, yeah, back 12 foot. Eight or nine, yeah, yeah. exactly. Okay, I like the draw here. Right. Hairless. With this little make wall it, it. back here, let's say this rock drops half buried in front of the T-line, then when it's hit, it might hit that yellow one on the corner. 20. 24. Where? Should, should be Top four. Okay. Well then. Might be a little. Might have to go a little. So then. Oh, guys. Oh, guys. No, Top four. Lots of room. Oh, guys. Top four. Top eight. Lots of room. Can you go right oh, back? T. Oh, we can four. finish it just a bit. Yep. Oh. Fish it. Oh. Great weight. Wow, I tell you what, great, yeah, good weight, but those two, Vanden Bosch and Wilson, knew out of his hand from just from the split. One was 20, one was 24. They said top four like that. Yeah, they took the split on it. It's a constant distance, so it gives them a rough idea where it's going to go. This path is very consistent, so the, the stopwatch is more effective when it's a consistent path. Nicely done. Needed just a four inches less ice, though, and they would have had that hidden. There is room here. But again, what do you do with it? You know, you may be able to slide it through the hole. Yeah. But there's so much junk back there. Yeah. yeah. And if you slide it through the hole with enough weight, you're going to roll out. So you've got to be really soft on the speed control here. Now it's craft and freeze. Freeze on the left, Kraft on the right. Got to get by this center guard coming up. Get by. Oh, they just did. And there's a little rub. They'll push their own back and almost through. Shot stone, though, for the moment, belongs to New Brunswick. They do have last rock here in four. Tight. Oh, this just gets <laughs> Getting to this red one's not the end of the world. It's it's where you're going to punch it through that yellow wall. It's a little tricky. Say 70. Yeah, probably 70. 
could jam it on any one of those quite easily. Don't think he can throw it light enough, Victor, get enough curl to punch it out towards the, the left hand side of the sheet. Touch down, maybe. Seven Pretty three. close. Oh. Bump. Oh. Close. Close. Oh. That's really good. Yep. Hard. Yep. Hard. Hard. And oh. Bosch and Wilson have got yep. him. Yep. yep. Here comes oh. that oh. guard oh. again. By that. Go, 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 go. And they do oh. avoid the jam and spill it through. And they're sitting. One, two, three for sure. <laughs> And it's close for that fourth spot. It's a really good illustration of how the, the nerves and the adrenaline get you going. And uh, Braden's starting to throw them softer and softer and softer. What a great comeback here after a couple of heavy throws. Just a beauty to thread it through the back one there and sit the three. As soon as they yelled, it's a little down. You knew he was going to make it. You guys are good at that. Uh, just a 10. Try to get the roll behind. You have more. The blank end is long gone, so if you're going to be forced, in the case of Rennie Como, you might as well be forced to two. So hit and flop underneath here. I think he can get across the nose. Yeah, there's a little more room this time. Okay. Lots of room to do it. Now, this is a hair heavier than the last one. No. Oh, boy. He had an idea. Maybe another few inches, and yeah. it would have, then it would have gotten across. Any lighter. Yeah. Shoot. That's it. Remember when we talked about the earlier call he made about ignoring the three enemy Manitoba stones and playing the draw. That's because he was confident knowing if it didn't work out, he was going to have to draw against a bundle. That's exactly what's going to happen here. Could be against four here. And at this point, it does look like the Manitoba stone on the edge of the 12. Control yep. up. Yep, yep. Is in. Control up. Hard. Oh! Oh boy, great throw. That's all right. There you go. So, yeah, again, again. Braden Calvert looking a little more comfortable now here in a second straight end. And it will be a draw against the four. He might be going to the hitter, Beck. I thought they'd draw also, but uh, Braden staying where he did took away that draw that they've been playing, that outturn draw, and I don't think they've played enough in-turn draws to be comfortable. I think he might be making a pass in this back one with a board weightish. Wow. But again, as you say, it's it's comfort level. Yeah, 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 but the, these rocks are so lively. You only have to be an inch and a half narrow, an inch high, and uh, you're going to give up a steal of a couple at least. Close. Yeah. Gotta go. Yep. Yep. Right out of his hand. Freeze yep. and crap handle. Go hard. Hard. Listen to really Wenzik. Hard. Really big hard. brush now. Freeze and crap. Trying to hold oh this for him. Hard. Uh -oh. Oh, yeah, and one. that will go by everything. Four. Let's see. Yeah, that's four. four. That is four, and that is a big, big mistake from Rene Como. Inside, got it started. Either way, it's four on the board. Here in Liverpool at Amera Center, Manitoba. Jumps in front of New Brunswick. At this stage of the game so early, this is a key shot. I thought he would draw. I thought he would too, Vic. And uh, because he, the lane was choked off by Braden on the other side, he decided that he didn't know this path and had to play the soft one. 
A little bit of a soft release also. It's a kind of a New Brunswick trade on straight ice. You can't do that at the swingy stop. Wow. Oh, poor dad, Randy. Can't believe it. His son gives up the steal of four. The key shot brought to you by Sponge Towel Paper Towels. Nothing absorbs like it. And so now, just like that, keep her going, keep her going, you're down keep her going. by four, and here in five, Rene Como will try to gather it up. He and the team from the Capital Winter Club in Fredericton, they once again will have the last rock. They have the hammer playing the Redstones. I got you What an amazing turnaround because we uh, saw Manitoba sputter out of the gate for sure. Uh, the 2 2 tie, uh, loss of control of hammer uh, was about the best they could do the way they were playing and, but a well played in by manitoba and it's all about applying pressure every curler if you make the shot hard enough is going to miss it and the draw obviously would have been uh, slightly simpler but i think renee was thinking you know if i make the double roll out even i'm only going to give up one maybe two and he'd love that one back do you think that he was do you think he was there, caught right? mentally by between what he wanted to play? Very well could be. Uh, because it, we, we all thought, we assumed the draw was coming, and they had played that intern draw in practice quite a bit too. So it's, it's a skip's Two. preference. And Try to make there's it some even. Uh, Colleen Jones would have hit it and made wow. it. Take a uh, look. You know, Ed Wernick would have drawn and made it. It just depends on your pretty close to that. your whoa, skill whoa, level, whoa, how yeah, you yeah. feel that day. But the, the problem with these particular rocks oh, is yeah, they're so lively. Yeah, Hitting and staying dead on is not as simple as... Good drawing the full eight foot uh, when you have the use of these wonderful brushers so it's easy to criticize after the fact but uh yep, just get the one all uh, said and it. done he was just narrow you got it oh lucas vandenbosch it's good luke good throw boy well, here we go we're in the fifth and the uh, the defense is on here. Is it ever? And uh, we know Manitoba's uh, arguably, maybe along with Alberta, the best hitting team here with that upweight ability. And it's, but get two at a time here. Get two right here. Try to force. It's, it's tons of time left. Uh, New Brunswick averaged One eight points a game. Eight. If they do that, uh, they could win this game. You never know. So two. Two. Try to make it even, guys. Plus one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Good. Yeah. If you're uh, Manitoba here, you want to get one at a time, too. There might be an outside chance at the double and roll away with a bullet, but that just throws your balance off, your timing oh. off, and you can make errors. You have to make one go away. Oh, yeah. Good throws. Out of boy, Braden. Nice throws. You do whatever you can if you're Manitoba to prevent a three. A you don't bit. want to give up no, a two. That first one didn't even try to curl. No. <laughs> Back four. But you can't start thinking three, so just take one off at a time. Hard line. Back eight. Back eight, back 12. Whoa, then. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Back 12. Back one. Whoa. Speed. Speed. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Take it over, Dan. Roll it. Hard, 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 hard. Yeah. Tried to roll it underneath the corner. Yeah, I like that. Just thought nose? Yeah. Okay, Dead nose is good. Hey. Two, cho two choices hey. here, Vic. You, you know, with the scoreboard the way it is, uh, the corner guard is a liability also. You could actually hit it, draw the plate into the rings, then you'd have a, a couple of tries at a double to uh, stop a potential yep. two. Nothing Hard wrong hit. with this play either, but if they sit Hard. three, none of these Hard. yellows are helping whoa, Manitoba. Oh, oh, oh. oh. oh boy. Great throw. What's your topping now? Okay. Because four. that yellow's there, you could freeze maybe in this spot. How do you get that yeah. thing out? You have to be careful with leaving as many yellows in play as you can with a big lead like this. Oh. 
nice balanced Where? delivery. Back for it. That little, uh, Stay close. Yep. Yep. Almost. Not yep. quite the little yep. lift, Hard. but he's got that Hard. sort of David Hard. Nedwin. That, yeah, the little, yeah. Yeah. Push right there. The curling Hard. delivery right that right could be up. done in a phone yeah. booth, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hard. <laughs> <laughs> the butt really never comes Hard. up. It just sort of goes yep. back and, yeah. Okay. Hey, Morris. Right. More and more young players are going to a uh, more simpler delivery. Just a little bit of a raise, Perfect stay weight. low. That gives him more power with his legs. Perfect weight. Jeez. His sliding foot right underneath his sternum. Shoulders really good and straight. I like the broom position. That's why these guys are here. So there's stuff there to work with if you're yeah. man at toe, but, but we do know how difficult it is, Russ, to generate points yeah. in the house. <laughs> yeah, it is, but if you can get a little yellow wall and the Manitoba's cooperating here, you can certainly weld one in there eventually. The unfortunate part right now is the wall is hidden by the shot rock, so they've got to do something with the shot rock. Just a little more. Where? Back 12. Back 12. Yep. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Rim. Rim. Stay close. Close. Yep. Whoa. 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 Curl. Curl. Come on. Oh, sorry. Good. Ghost? I don't mind his nose. Yeah. Great call. Nose it. Get rid of some of that yeah. yellow. If you peel it. New Brunswick taps it. the shot rock back. There's that wall of three yellow Manitoba stones, and it's going to be hard to remove the red. So Nose is pretty good. Straight back. It's exceptionally you good. You don't like inside How out? How much weight? Normal? Oh, this is good. Okay, you got it. I feel. Okay. Nose is good. Okay, you got it. Well, they've been talking about uh, Braden Calvert in Manitoba for a number of years now, back in... 2011 yep. in a, a big yep. spiel yep. in Brandon. Hard. The age of Hard. 15, he came Hard. back winning five Hard. straight go, 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 go. to take the bond spiel. Oh boy. And then he'll get rid of one. Shooter rolls over, still sitting the four. Yep. Oh, man. Very talented young man, Braden Calvert. Manitoba men's provincials and women's provincials uh, would be similar to what you face here. The, it's so yeah, much well, depth. Either way, he's gonna rip it. If we go here, probably goes underneath this. Yeah. Tap this one. You could tap this one. Yeah, here. that's pretty good. That's I think. Probably the best thing. Yeah. the way, I think. Yeah. Back four, what do you think? 90? Yeah, if you're up by four, you can give... You have 6, 08, 09, 10, 11. <laughs> you raise, uh, End of pretty much every... <laughs> not, 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 not. You have reason to smile. Didn't start out that way for mm -hmm. Manitoba through the first uh, three. They looked a little more comfortable in the third after seeing the, seeming a little out of kilter. Back to what we talked about at the opening, Vic, is uh, you, you kind of, if you're a... The hey, Brunswick fan, you, you, you wish they'd put rocks in play more. right off the bat when the Watch Manitoba was a little rusty. No. It's got to move. Well, it's not bad. Trying to put one right no, down on the face. No, don't touch it. The stone center line back of the button. Don't touch it. Uh, Close, yeah. No. No, no. Yeah. No. Shot. And as we talk, now the yellows aren't really your friend if you're Manitoba. This is a pretty difficult shot to remove this. Like back four weight? I don't mind that. It's going nowhere. Just back four, yeah. Just back it up a bit. You could hit it really skinny. I don't like no, that. Alright, let's play back four. You got it. 
right there. You can't get the red oak because of this yellow. You can't get the red oak because of this yellow. And if you bounce it off there, it'll go that way because of this yellow it stays. And all self-inflicted by you keeping rocks in play. Yeah. And, uh, and then, of course, four. wherever this shooter ends up may allow you a chance to look at your deuce. Oh, for sure. A little less. Good call here, though. Just, just kind less. of a tap freeze. Try to stay right on top. You know, the, uh, the idea of hitting it thin and trying to squirt it through the hole, that was quickly... Uh, yeah, it might be there, but it's so tough. You make this one, it's an extremely hard deuce. It's got to be perfect. The pitcher shook off the uh, catcher on that idea. Like <laughs> We're not That's doing that. That's right. Yep. Oh, good. Oh, it's yep. Braden Calvert. This is the final for the... Oh. Manitoba oh, skip out of the Deer Lodge in Winnipeg. Back four. Wait pretty oh. good. Back four, back eight. Has to oh. Oh, right here. Oh, it's oh, back oh. four. Oh, no, no. Ah. Ah. Killed it. Our bad. Didn't curl at all. Sorry, Braden. Enough room? It just didn't curl. Oh, for sure. Uh, that's Anything. our fault. Anything on the nose works. Right. Yeah. It looks what, like a, like a tan? Yep. And a great example again for the young skips. The yellow rocks eventually caught up to them. Made that shot a little difficult. Knows it with a ten. Yep. But you go back then into the end. I thought they were I thought they were starting to peel guards. Yeah. And they, they and they right and they had that chance. At one point they they were sitting to the third shot was New Brunswick and they could have peeled the guard. They decided to hit the one in the rings but asked for it to stay. That's the one at the top of the forefoot. And, from that point on, it's uh, to New Brunswick credit, they've worked to a position that forced Manitoba to a tough shot, and that's what it's all about. Really good chance for two here. Yep. yep. Final stone. Whoa. Whoa. New Brunswick, time. Rene Como. Clean, clean, clean. Whoa. Yep. After giving yep. up the yep. four yep. 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 on a missed Five. shot in four. And he does well to get two right back. New Brunswick will go to the break. Down by a couple, and they're playing for those trophies. The M&M Meat Shop's Canadian Juniors are brought to you by Tim Hortons Coffee. Always served fresh within 20 minutes. Always great tasting coffee. Welcome back to Liverpool, Nova Scotia, the Amera Center. Midway through this men's final of the M&M Meat Shops Canadian Junior Curling Championship. I'm joined by Ian Mitchell of M&M Meat Shops. Nice to see you. Nine years of sponsorship of the National Juniors. I don't know what the company's thoughts were nine years ago, but uh, did you think you'd be here today? Well, I tell you, nine years ago was a long time, and uh, I'm not sure we had the vision to see this far into the future, but we've had an amazing partnership with the sport of curling. Uh, we know curling is enjoyed by Canadians from coast to coast of all ages, and in communities large and small. And I know our franchisees take great pride in knowing that the sponsorship of this event is helping develop uh, fine young curlers and fine young Canadians. And you tell a wonderful story about uh, some of the product being on the different tables around town and, uh, and the curlers. Yes, yeah, I heard from the organizing committee when I got here that uh, these curlers were hungry folks and they certainly loved the M&M food and they, uh, they took all of it, ate it all, and next year we're going to have to look at uh, the quantities we're putting out for them. Well, that bodes well then, possibly for another nine years of sponsorship. Mr. Mitchell, thank you so much. And thank you very much too, Vic, you and Russ and the entire TSN crew for your continued sponsorship of this event and the sport of curling. Our pleasure. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Alongside their uh, coach, Damian Layton, New Brunswick got two back, and that's a big two after they gave up that steal of four. The M&M Meat Shop's Canadian Juniors are brought to you by Scotty's Facial Tissue. Scotty's, the perfect touch by Capital One. What's in your wallet? And by Ford, proud partner of the Canadian Curling Association for over 20 years.
It's been a short stay, but a wonderful visit to the south shore of Nova Scotia here in Liverpool on the uh, Mersey River. And what an undertaking it is to host this M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors. 28 teams, 14 in men's play, 14 in women's play, the 10 provinces, northern Ontario, the three territories. To the chairman, Greg Thorburn, and his entire committee, thank you for making us feel so welcome. And to everyone that we've met around this part of Queen's County and Liverpool, thank you very much for making us feel so welcome. As we welcome you back to this men's final, that is a huge two for New Brunswick in the fifth. And Manitoba up by a couple, leading 6-4. We'll have the last rock playing the Yellowstones here in six. A little bit of soft, at least. Mine's good. You feel we'll like you're way ahead head. if you're Manitoba, we but did. you're not. You know, one steal or a force, give up a deuce. It's a one-point game. Deep. Way too many things deep. can happen with uh, five ends to play. And really deep. Where? I like uh, what Tom Clasper did to the team Take here when he walked out in that fifth Back end heat. break. He's, he's so calm, Beck. Yep, he coached Brian Meekin this year, and my daughter was on That's the team in the right, fall. Guys. and. It really helps these young players in these type of situations. They're all, they all get it. They all understand the strategy, but it's, it's that staying in, in that bubble and staying, not getting too high when you're winning and not getting too low when you're losing. And uh, Tom's one of the best. He's coached for a long, long time in Manitoba. Got room, where? Five. Four, five. Five. Four. Okay, yeah, yeah, Four. yeah. I think it's almost easier for the team that's behind as they, uh, they, they've got nothing to lose. It's, it's time to score some goals. You get a little more aggressive and you know exactly what you have to do. The team that's winning it, you, you, you'd love to score more points when the chances are there, but you have to be careful with that scoreboard. Here, Les. Yep. And there is uh, Tom Clasper, as you mentioned, coached Brianne Meekin and uh, your daughter to a CIS gold. And then, of course, go further back, and he was the coach of Connie Laliberti for three yeah. years. They won a Scotties in 1995 yeah. and then went on to uh, win a good. silver Where? medal at the Worlds. It's good. It's pretty Whoa. close. Line's good. Top Little line's getting there. Top eight. Little Little line. Line. You got room. We need more coaches in this, uh, in this great sport for the young teams. It's, uh, it's nice to see. Sit down. Sit. 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 Ah. That's fine. Nice chance here already from uh, the uh, New Brunswick boys. Two guards out front. Rock behind the tee line right where they want it. Well, one on right on the button. Bit right tight. Right where? Seven, eight. Okay, whoa. Yeah, we're all there. Nine, ten. Whoa. Close. It's not bad. No. No, we're still nine. I use the word well, Vic, because fees, freeze is already Nine. thrown, so I can't use that again. Nine. <laughs> oh. Linda, <laughs> Linda, <laughs> come back. Yeah. You got it. The problem with the two guards are staggered uh, on the angle. The New Brunswick uh, coaches Damian Layton. He's uh, a lawyer by trade. Actus Laws, where he works. Yep. Hard. He's the president of Hard. the New Brunswick Curling Association oh. out of Moncton. Oh. He's only yeah. been with the team for eight weeks. Interesting story with him. So the team didn't have a coach. And as the president of the association, he said, you know what? I can't ask people to volunteer and be coaches if I'm not going to lead by example. And he dove right lives, in. But he went and uh, yeah. took his coaching classes, oh, did his he's online certification, so, you know, right, right and so now he is has his level two, and he's here as a as the coach. Team can't be here without a level two, and kudos to Damien. It's uh, he's already played the game for six or seven years. He was in a couple of our clinics Three. way back, and uh, dedicated yeah. player. And yeah. it's nice to see him as our president. Well, it's, uh, you actually hard. taught him. Well, he, he won't admit it. Yeah. Yeah. Surprise! He's still in the game. <laughs> 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 but uh, we were chatting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He has some wonderful ideas. Uh, whoa, whoa, one whoa, I thought whoa. was really good whoa. was okay. there is, of course, that training center in the West at the Savile Community.
Sports Center. He says there should be uh, a companion training center in the eastern provinces, in the Maritimes. Absolutely, and that's really what we're trying to do at the Bossier yep. Curling Club yep. and the uh, Curl Moncton really facility. My buddy Grant Odishaw is uh, doing a lot of work there, Elry Robichaux, and the, you're right, Vic, it's, it's, it's so difficult for the Eastern teams to travel, let's say, to the Savile Centre in Alberta to train, and obviously financial, just time away is the hard part, so why not do it in this big country, have another one down here somewhere, and uh, get the top Eastern teams, uh, get to that one notch, that one little notch better. You, you only have to make one or two more shots than some of these teams out here, and you're the best in the world. Playing third stones here in the sixth. Manitoba up by a couple. Shot stone, though, is T line, just edge of the button. It belongs to New Brunswick. Two. Whoa, lots of rim still. Gotta go soon. Get ready. Yep. Hard. 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 Hard, 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 hard. A little bit long. Yeah, I thought they were a little late. The uh, the brushers were a little late communicating that because Skipper thought it was coming a little deeper. Right. Therefore, it would curl a little more, and the, the shot's perfect. But pretty uh, long, eh? There's the comment. Mm -hmm. What was that? Like half? Yeah, I can see a third. Okay. If you're that tight, you're tight. That extra yeah. length gives kind of more time yeah. for this rock to curl, makes it an it's easier shot. And I love that comment. If you're tight, you're tight. That's. You don't want to miss all your shots, but if you're going to, you cannot be wide here. You have to miss it tight. Take that Just guard off. Up. Hard. 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 Go. Hard. 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 Keep going. Keep going. Ah, okay. That's fine. And they won't get it by despite how long it was. So it's 6 4 on the board, Manitoba. Let's we check the numbers after five. Well, the scoreboard uh, doesn't really do justice what to happen in the game. Uh, 86 to 84, that's as close as it gets. They were like that all week. But that one shot, it was the big difference, obviously. A five-point swing in that uh, faithful fifth, fourth end. The numbers after five are brought to you by Tim Hortons, Canada's favorite coffee. Mine's fine. We're two. Clean it. Two. Clean it. Yeah, two, three. Higher, higher's better. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not whoa, in. Whoa. It's fine. Shut. Hey. Heel. You got it. Just gotta make the shots at the right time. You know, just scanning the uh, percentages. Uh, Renee is actually out curling Braden by 3%, which isn't Heel. a lot, but whoa, it's uh, whoa, that yeah. one shot. Oh, dear. And what a miss it was. Watch Steal a four in the fourth. Oh, oh, oh. That's a nice shot to open it up. Get them both. Nice shot. Is it ever? That could go on the scoreboard. That's a beauty. Perfect. What? I thought we had to hit a little sticker. <laughs> you it? always think that. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Knowing, well, we hit a hair thicker, we're sticking on the line. Knowing your yeah. angles. Trying to narrow the edge. Yeah, if you rolled off a little bit and move here, I don't think the double, the double will be really hard. Cause just guard it. If you miss the guard, though, it's four. Wow, if I miss this, it's... Things what, do you guys, what do you guys like? I like calling a timer now. Sure. So a timeout being called. I just it here. Realizing again. I think we've got to skinny this. It's not bad if you can get there. Like, th it's good if we make it. I said, even, if, it, even if we. Here. Exactly. Like, if we're here, it's terrible. It's, yeah, it's horrible. You might get lucky you for play two. This and roll I said, there, if you, if you roll, if you roll off. Here. If you roll off this a little yeah, bit. Yeah, that's not bad, I guess. Like if you're going to chip this and roll Even if here. I'm thin, I roll into that, right? Yeah, and this one comes here. Maybe he picks it and we hit him. Do you, like, we can do this. I don't like really like the guard now that that's in. Yeah. Do you like getting a few rocks out of play there? Lots of the order order thinking this and roll. And I don't mind that. Behind that. Yeah. As long as I don't, mind, over. I don't mind this either. I just need to make it. it. Yeah. No, so he's he's just gonna throw a bullet in there. And yeah, but it. if I'm here, he's he's just getting it's, rid of that. Just, yeah. Just dead jammy. I don't know. 
Whatever you feel like. I'd be throwing a hit and roll if you ask me, but yeah. sure call. And we'll squirt behind it. Like it's I like that. I like it. This one the hit and roll is What do I throw at it, though? Because I can't see all of this, can I? Yeah, you, you can, can see, see all it all. I'm, yep. I'm pretty sure if you roll the other way, you're going to roll something. Yeah, like yeah, you roll into there. there. If I hit it, there's there. no way. I don't think there's so, any way you roll out. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's good. Do you like just playing for that? I like playing for the roll. I like playing for the roll. Just go here. He's not getting rid of it. Well, the thing is, we might leave that or something. It's here. Yeah, this is gonna be like if we roll over here. This that one. This isn't moving anywhere. Unless That's gonna stay right here. Yeah. Gonna, it might move to here. The only way this is moving, I think, to here is if I. You gotta hit real. I'm playing that. I don't mind. Do you, do you like playing that? Well, I don't mind playing that. If we throw, I mean, if we throw control, get rid of two yellows. Yeah. Yeah. If we throw control, hit it here. This isn't going anywhere, and you roll to go here. That's fine. I like that. I like just throwing a nine and playing that. Yep, that's fine. Okay. Even an eight. Basically two options. They can here. try to freeze or yeah. they can try to like hit the eight. yellow where yep. they're uh, motioning now and roll across to where the left hand red Even I've drawn in the, on their ISO here. But what the problem with the freeze is if the freeze stops in that type of area, there's such an easy double. If it stops over there, there's such an easy double. If it ever stops there, there's an easy double. So I like this call. Eliminate one yellow. Roll over here. Eliminates two yellow. Then for Manitoba, you only have second shot. You have to deal with shot rock, which is close to second rock, and you might set up another double. Two well-played doubles here can get New Brunswick out of a bit of a jam. They talked about the straight guard originally, Vic, and that... Uh, that is over the edge if that guard on the swingy ice isn't in the right spot. Uh, they're looking at a big end here. Well, that's it. They're looking at all the yellows in there, realizing that Manitoba does also have the yep. hammer here yep. in six. Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. No. 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 Yep! Yep! Hard! Whoa! Whoa! One. And two. Very nice. Rene Como, just the way he thought it out. Any harder, he gets all three, or at least sits two. That moved a lot further than I thought it would. Yeah, that squirted a lot. And the reason they do is that because of these uh, striking bands, they're so uh, convex. more weight and tried to yeah. get it out. At the uh, local curling remember. club in Fredericton, that yellow one wouldn't have moved six inches. And it actually squirted right out of the eight foot, amazingly. Just control. I guess if you know that he slashes and rolls out, right? Yeah. You got the blank. Anyway. You got it. Nose is perfect for that exact reason. Well thought out by the uh, Manitoba team here. Yes, you'll leave a double, but if you make the double, Rene Como is going to roll out, and now you have the opportunity to blank the end. Oh, oh. Yep. 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 Oh. 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 No, no, no. Sit there. Hi, boy. And he does. Right there. I don't like that. Very nice shot. Yeah. Or I just try to rip the double. I guess. Then that you're hitting it about here. Yeah. Go for blank. Yeah. Do you like trying the double or yeah. the hit and roll? I like trying the double. Yeah. Yeah, that's what though. Because I mean, even like we hit and roll to here, he's just gonna play back line. Yeah. Tap, roll, yeah. Like. That's true. Right here. Same weight. Yep. Peel. I think so. So it's like a, th a third. No, like a half, right? I'm going to get it. Hit it right here. Half's too thin. I think they need more than half to make this. They could jam it with half. It's about half. It's a thick yeah. half. Peel weight really needs to make the double here. don't think. It depends on the speed. They're taking quite a bit of ice. They might be throwing normal weight, Vic, trying peel to weight. make the double and hang around. Oh, there's the comment. Peel weight. Probably will roll out with this. Final stone for New Brunswick. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here in six. Whoa, Made a right great off. shot with his first. Rene Como. Freeze yep. and craft. Yep. Now some late licks. Got it. One, two, and out it goes. Wonderful throw, nice line call. And Dad Randy happier than he was earlier. Line call Daniel Wenzik. And two doubles.
And as you say, it has got them out of a lot of trouble. Two great doubles. Absolutely perfect doubles. You couldn't miss either one of those or you lose the game. Now they're right in this thing. I haven't played this spot uh, with uh, hit weight. Yep. Come off. Hard. Hard. Clean. Yep. 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 Brandon clean. Bosch and Wilson. Clean. Clean. Oh boy. Good Kerr's boy. calling line. And there it goes. So what looked to be a possible big end again for Manitoba. Results in a blank. They hold the lead and the last one. All right, way back machine to 1999. Canadian Juniors in Kelowna for the third straight year. John Morris had reached the final. He had won the previous year in Calgary. Made it two in a row in Kelowna. Morris along with Craig Savile, Jason Young, Brent Lang. They beat Jeff Richard and BC 7-3. And they would go on to win gold at the World Juniors in Ostersund, Sweden. What a great team. And what a wonderful player, John Morris, when you think of what he did at the junior level, world juniors, and then, of course, that Olympic gold in Vancouver, having uh, being the only Canadian to win a world junior, a world men's championship, and Olympic gold. John Morris. And then when you think about it, one game away from representing Canada. Exactly. In Sochi. Losing to Brad Jacobs in the curling trials final. Welcome bit. back to yes. Liverpool. I'm just giving you a bit too much. We are in oh, Nova Scotia on the South Shore okay. final day here for the M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors. The blank in six means that Manitoba continues to lead by two, six, four. They also have the last rock. They have the hammer again. Where? Here in seven, five, playing the Yellowstone. Five's good. Ah, oh, we're all there. Six, yeah, seven. it's running. Close for line, though. Line only. Whoa, whoa, All there. whoa, whoa. We're bumping. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hard, 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 hard. No roll in the red. Good on. Yeah, Johnny learned his craft back right line. here in the juniors with so many uh, appearances that oh, exposure back you back get line. at this national line. level is, so is so important to these top teams. Second, third end, third end. Yep, yeah. back line hack. Hard, hack. hack. Hard, really gotta go. All the way. Hard, hard, hard. Right up. Hard. It's all over the guard. Hard. How far is that guard gonna move? Jeez. Stick oh, yeah. around. Stick. And into the bumper it goes, so back it goes. Well, they started playing for the Canadian Men's Junior Championship 1950 in Quebec City. Alberta leading with 16 championships. The last was Brendan Botcher. That was in Apennine in 12. Nova Scotia just the one title. That's Sean Adams. That was in 1993 when he won it in Trois-Rivières. New Brunswick's last. Ryan Sherrard, 2004, and of course Manitoba looking to defend the championship won by Matt Dunstone last year. Can I kiss the peel? <coughs> I don't mind just the peel. <coughs> I can't guard them both. I like this one. Yeah. Back line. Take the guard. Three at the far end like the peel better, but the uh, let the skipper pick call the shot. Both of them are good idea. You just uh, you hit and stay here. It forces New Brunswick to play a defensive shot as opposed to an offensive. Right, you roll out, you're not happy. Back line. Oh, yep, yep. Hard, hard. Oh, Lucas oh. Vandenbosch. Ah. Oh, guys. Ah. Oh, that bumper. On the Overbrush this a bit. Okay. Yep, yep. Let me know the way it is. And they yeah, don't get rid of anything. They push one just sideways. Right. Still leaving New Brunswick sitting the two, but without Last Rock here in seven. Well, this is a turning point here, possibly. You heard Braden say, let me know what the weight is. We did hear a sig any noise at all out of the front end. 
on that sweeping call there, and the, uh, he didn't realize how hard it was coming, overbrushed it. Seven. Where? Seven. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Wait till there. No. No, wait no, 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 no. We got tons no, of wait till there. Too. We're back. No, Jordan we're back. Kraft. We're back. No, 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 no. It's going to curl. Curl. Six. Stay with Six. it. Still whoa, yep. still whoa. Still whoa, 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 Run it back, try to get that stuff off the yep. four foot area. Hard! 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 Wilson and Kurz go, run go, it go, back go. and drives it by. And then look where the shooter rolls. It just now it covers the four. Also covers oh, an out turn path to the button if they need it later for Manitoba. Three. Three just slightly over curled here. I don't even mind higher than this. Okay. Actually, no, go deeper. Like deeper. So too deep, you yep. Not too deep, because you know what they're going to do. They're going to try to run it back in again. Where? One, two. Whoa two. for line. Whoa. Three. No. There, guys. Two, three. Way out there. Three. Line's gonna be good. Because of the rotation, this Whoa, will continue to glide. If it continues Three, to glide, it has lots of time no, to curl fine. that extra few inches Bye they're down. worried about. Set. Good. And it finally does, just as it nibbles the top of the 12 foot. Yep. Nose. Right on nose. Okay. Nose. If this is perfect, it's a tough shot, but you could almost get them all, Vic. You never hit it right where the broom is. I'm sure they'd be happy just get the one off the button, though. That's the main deal. We'll try that now with Kill Kyle Kurz. No. The yeah. edges come off this oh, yeah. Manitoba team for the moment. You know, in another sport, another team Great sport, course. you might say the team has been a little sloppy. Yeah, yeah, and exactly. It, if that applies here, I'm just not lost. making the, a lot of half shots, huh? And I, I think in that case, uh, you know, I mentioned there, you could get all four to go. When you think that way, you throw it harder because mm -hmm. you, you're trying to move all that granite. You throw it harder, you've got, you don't have the room in the right spot anymore. Two. Where? Two. Whoa, whoa. Line's fine, guys. Line's good. Just let it move. A bit. Let Two. it move. Where? Two. Almost a three. Almost a three. Let it Might finish. Need to finish. Three. Gotta finish oh. a bit. Oh, well, no, no, that's good. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was pretty well. That was, that was you love it when it's the uh, your own rock uh, that's coming in to the rings for uh, New Brunswick. Yep. Hard. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. whoa. Kerr's going to try it again. Oh, and he gets him going. <laughs> yeah. What a beauty that is. Runs it back, gets rid of two of them, almost all. That's better. <laughs> Looks a lot better. Skipper starting to oh, breathe again. Second one I swim tight. Second one I swim tight. Yeah. Which is better. <laughs> I'm going to at least put it out. Yeah. So. That's fine. The... Uh, top four. Yeah. That's been throwing a million of rocks. Uh, Kyle's basically yeah, saying I'm better to, I did slide five. tight, which isn't perfect, but I'm better to do that because of the, my nature of my delivery, the nature of the release. He knows that it, it's an outward motion on those peels.
Got some ram. Ready, Como. First skip Wait stone. Wait only. You're in the seventh. Wait if you Watch can. Room. Still Watch has something okay. to hide Line's behind. Good. There's. Got to move still. Yeah. Yep. Manitoba stone just covering it's the four hard, foot hard, out in front. Hard. hard. Wow. That's and hard. here it comes. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, 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 I could overcrawl oh. there. Sit, 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 sit. And it will pop out the other side. Who's pulling that too? <laughs> you got it. Girl. Should be able to get the inside. What? I thought you floated that a bit. No, I... And it still curled. Five it feet. certainly curled. Five feet. There's the call. They expected four. You got it. Don't think there's enough room to be cute here and try to sliver the guard and roll inside. Because if you ever That's more. fracture on the guard, you got it. you're going to have a lot harder shot with your next one. So the way the score is, make this go away and roll into the open. Back up, bump. Yep. yep. Braden Calvert. Hard. 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 Wow. Vandenbosch on the right. Hard. Wilson. Hard. Here comes that guard. Hard. Here they go. Here comes that guard. Jeez. Yo. Wow. Oh. Had to stay away from that guard, and the worst part was it didn't move it enough. It was, hard, hard guys, I wish it had been worse hard, on the broom and peeled the guard. But just moves that guard about four inches, so it's still very usable for New Brunswick. They're yep. lying two. Okay. So like middle eight. <laughs> New Brunswick! It depends on what you want Braden to do with his last one. Do you want him to, if you want him to draw, you want to tuck this a little bit. Just if you want him to hit twelve, like a, a piece tuck. Piece tuck, there it is. Just a piece underneath, and then there's no middle double. Eight, Dan. You could also leave it wide open, top 12, and then he has to Same make way. the double just to give no, you one. Touch less. Top 12. So, four. What was that four. time? Was it, that was like a four. That was a four. So, a 405. Okay. Even a 410. Like a 403, that's fine. Okay. Early. Early. Yeah, early. Early guys, hard. Where is it? Hard. Keeping it early to it? keep it straight. He thought he was a little three, soft two, on that intern. Three, yep. Two, yep. Two. If it's three, just let it die. Let it die. Whoa, it's whoa. really it curling. We're going for like a four. If it's a four. Whoa! Might just overlap a little bit here. Over Slip curling. underneath. Sit. We're, whoa. whoa! We're in. And there I are in, just to uh, bite the top. Victor, Rene had that one tough one there, the steal of four, but his wrist is really high. And it, it's not ideal. When your wrist is that high, what happens is you tend to roll it past 12 o'clock when you let it go. And Are it's we? just so easy to be a shade down. narrow. Now, Rene plays uh, down east, and most of the ice surfaces are straight, and you want to do that because you can get that extra curl and, and bury when there's only two, two and a half feet of finish. But on arena conditions with these great ice makers like Jamie Barraza, that soft release is a disaster because yeah. it'll just take right off, and he just softened that enough to leave it, it exposed here, and there's room for Manitoba. You know, good decision there by Daniel Wenzek to uh, just drag it into the top edge. Well, so now, way, with his last, Braden Calvert facing three. Oh. Be close. All you guys. You need need a button, guys. All you guys. Vanden Bosch on the yeah, right, Wilson on the left. All you guys. Sit down. Oh boy. Sit. Yeah, they're talking. Sit. They're talking to sit. it. Okay. That'll be a steal of one. And it will finally sit back edge of the eight. New Brunswick will pick up a steal of one. Who would have thought this? After leading six to two, it's now a one point game.
Yesterday at this time, it was the women's final. Alberta against British Columbia. Kalia Van Osh out of BC. Kelsey Rock and her team from the Saddle Community Sports Center in Edmonton. That hit and stick in 10 for the win, 7-6. As they made that walk of a champion and then posed for the pictures. Kelsey Rock, Keely Brown, Taylor McDonald, and Claire Tully, along with their coach, Amanda Don Fader. They're now off to the World Championship to be played in Flim, Switzerland, but not before they're here and all excited about this men's final. <laughs> That's a bad break. Oh. A young lady right in the middle is Kelly, uh, is Kelsey Rock. No Trying to win a Canadian first uh, board. Canadian board? Women's World Championship yeah. since Marlies Miller, now Marlies Kasner, and that was in Flims back in 2003. Yes. Whoa. Whoa. Sorry, Ryan. They're pretty good. Okay, Ryan. Well, I'll tell you this. Uh, I didn't expect it. I really didn't. Uh, it's just, Bro. you know, after that mistake, the flash by uh, Rene Como in four to give up the steal of four to make it 6-2. But then you go back. I didn't expect to be here at this point. But then you go back to the fifth. And the two they got. All those rocks left in yeah, play. Exactly. Gets oh. them two. Yep. Plank. Yep. And now the steal of one oh. and seven. And it's oh. one point. Right off, it's game on for sure. And uh, in the case of New Brunswick, Close. they don't have to really Hard gamble roll. as much now. Even a, ah. even a force to one here is not all that bad. You get two and nine, you're tied. And during the break, under or center line's fine. We Manitoba coach in. Tom Clasper was out in if we and, here. and emphasized the point that, that look, fellas, we made some mistakes there. Let's get back to the game, clean up the mistakes, and then the game will come back Close to off. us. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Whoa. Yeah. Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Soft. Yeah. Whoa. Tom. Yeah. Uh, Hard. It's been a well-known coach in the uh, the hotbed of Manitoba, Winnipeg, Winnipeg area, and it's 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 those messages that uh, can make the difference in this game. Troll. What? I'll make an assumption here. What you don't want this Manitoba team is to start doubting themselves, yep. mm. questioning yep. everything they do, yeah. because they're going. They're going to be nervous as it is. They were the favorite coming in, and for them to see this lead start to slip away. Oh, no, for sure. That's fine. And, and you, you, you tend to do it because the scoreboard told you to do it. You, you, the last thing you want to do is, uh, you know, try for a bunch of points and give up a multiple steals. So they're, they're doing the old, uh, you're, you're up two touchdowns. It's okay to give them a five yard and five yard here and five yard. But those five yard passes add up to mm -hmm. touchdowns, and that's yeah, a little bit right. what I think is happening here. This is a massive and a steal here, really and it's game hard. on. If Manitoba even hey. scores a single, they're going to feel hard. pretty good about it. Jordan Kraft. Hard, right up, right up, right up, right up. Oh, he actually gets almost, doesn't bite it, doesn't get it in, but uh, does it a little roll underneath. Just a slight Let's go. overlap as well. You got it. You got it. You got it. Not a I'm massive good. fan of this Which call. Oh, the the double peel is so easy, Vic. You make the double peel roll out. You've got your blank. Now, if you ever Eight. score a decent a number in uh, the ninth end, like a deuce, the game is in Back really good shape. Here, you can give up a steal by playing this call. Back eight. Oh, you. Oh. Okay. And good. deep they go. No worries, Back eight. Not fine there. It's not wrong. They might have said, hey, we've got to stop yeah, the bleeding. Let's go for our deuce. But Fine. that's exactly what right. New Brunswick's looking for. Yeah, I'll throw them with the guards. i to give it to you. And then the added problem, of course, oh, going to the back end. Oh, a good point. Yeah, that's useless there, really. 
And you always say you can't bring them back. That's hard. Is you got to be an awfully good curler to bring them back. Golf, you can do it, but you can spin them back. But it's hard to do it. I gotta go a bit. Where? Four. Switch and go. Line's great, guys. Look up, look up. Take a look. You got room. Freeze on the left, craft on the right. Get ready to go at the end. Yep. Look yep. up, boys. Hard! 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 Hard. Right go, go, go. Hard, Jordan. Keep her going. Go, 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 go. go. T line. Edge of the pin. You like just tapping it a bit. I see less than half. It's the tap. What do you guys like? Can like we double the guards and roll over? Yeah. Yeah, just tap it back a bit. Do, do you like the double double peel on the guards? No, I don't think so. Okay. You got it. I do. I think the coach does too. Back the last four? thing uh, yeah. Tom said to the team in the break was, "I guess you we're fine. If we score is... one here, we're double still okay. We're two over, up, right? playing nine. Yeah. I don't mind it. Okay. Okay, peel. Yeah. Have a hair more? Yeah. Oh, and they've gone to it. I love the call. It was well thought out. You got it. Well, that might help turn that frown upside down on Coach Plaster's <laughs> face. He wasn't. Oh. Uh, he didn't look too happy. Kyle Kurz. Okay. Uh, I'll get one. Could have actually brushed that. They want to hit it the other way, but if you brush that, the red one would be kicked over even farther. But it's okay. It's off that four-foot strip. Now you get a realistic chance of scoring, which is the key. Line's pretty good. Where? Eight. Line's good. Where? Three. Lots of room. Hey, whoa, you gotta wait for lots of room. Two. Let it okay. move. Stay close. Let us Get ready. Yeah. Hard. Really hard. 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 Cross center. Hard. Go, 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 go. Not quite. Just That's touching good. it. Let me cover a corner. Jeez. Go hack. Okay. Hack? <coughs> yep. Okay. <sighs> hack. No. Bump. Oh. No, no. No. Just bump. Close. Oh. oh. Never. Never. Curl. Hard on the red? Girl, a little bit more. No, I just came across to catch enough to push it out. Well, I, the one shot really stands out for Rene Como, that flash to give up the steal of four. Well, first of all, you'd be close to 90% and the score would be a lot different than it is. You're right, just that one shot, but both great numbers. Anything over 80 in the Canadian final is exceptional. Player numbers are brought to you by Capital One. What's in your wallet? You should be able to, I think you can throw a nine and be, nine would be okay. Yeah. You should have room on that side. I gotta roll under. Makes the choice a little easier. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they could play the come around here. It's a wee bit dangerous, but you are one down and you don't have last rock. So you'd pivotal eighth end, you'd love to steal a point. It'd be difficult to steal with this rock coming down here now. Well, then two, if you go back yep, to the yep. last yep. end, you forced yep. Braden Calvert to draw. He whoa, did whoa. That's right. the draw. Whoa. Plus. So, no, you no. know, if you could have wrapped one around, maybe Russ left it high in the house. Exactly. 
Well, you talked about the high risk versus low risk. You like the head of the draw. Well, exactly. With uh, Braden on, or sorry, uh, Rennie on the left hand I, side, it's, it's a much uh, higher yeah, risk. You can see the big difference there with uh, Braden's down lower. What that does is it, it changes your <laughs> wrist position, it changes your arm. Now, when the left hand rock rolls over, it rolls over a little bit too far, and that's already curling and less rotation. Bumper. See much more rotation on that yellow rock there from. Uh, Braden, and that's because of that lower wrist. That's the way to throw it, I think, at the lower wrist. Now, Rennie's in the it. Canadian final, and he's 86%, so who am I? But it's, it's just two different styles. Part of it is there's horses for different courses, and in the case of Eastern Canada, you play so much on the straighter surfaces that high wrist does work because you can get a little bit more curl. And you get the rocks into some of those spots that bump, you bump can't up. if you throw it the other way. Close. Whoa. Bump up. Yep, yep. Oh, oh. Braden Calvert, oh. his right first. Off. Remembering now, Manitoba does Curl. have last rock. Curl. Stick. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, boy. Nice. And again here. Those little Firm. things. Those little mistakes. Yeah, that had to hang around. Just to hang around anywhere. It might have forced New Brunswick's hand to hit it. Now a wonderful opportunity to tie this game up. Yeah. Definitely didn't curl a lot. No. A little firm, but... Yeah. Sleepers can hold it. Just ice a little less. Yeah. Do that one perfect. That's real. Right there. Just a hair less. All right. So, 95, 4. So they're going to go behind the higher center guard, are they? Yes, exactly. With the better... I don't know ask why not the the corner? Well, the corner didn't. Can you get there? I guess is the question. Yeah, you'd have to go on that same side, on the outturn side. But it, it, if you make it, you're really not shrinking the scoring area. Okay. Yeah, ideally, you want to shrink it. To your point, though, this is a longer guard, and it might be accessible. But if you can put this top four Rim. foot, you Wait's really shrink that scoring Watch area. Wait, it's not bad. Stay with it. Stay close. Close. Yep. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Hard. 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 Whoa, Freeze off. and crack. Wait, wait only. Never, never. Yeah. It's gonna overcurl. Line's good. It's gonna overcurl. Top four. I heard no, the six. better. That could be deep. Six. Yeah. Six. six. Yeah, they didn't need that little bit of brush. It'll just dig in back of the button. Are they gonna attack it from the other side now? Yeah, it's poking out on the intern side a little bit. Still a good shot, but boy, two feet lighter. It would have been right underneath cover. It's a similar shot that was just missed one end ago. Is it back button? Yeah. I don't know. It's front button. A little less. You got it. That's less. Oof. If there's been an error, and I, I like to jot them down as a coach, it, the pattern has been wide here for Team Manitoba. So you cannot, if you're Braden Calvert, overthrow this rock. Yep. Got quite a bit. Back eight. Be all oh, there. New Brunswick back is sitting line. one. Back eight. Yep. Close. Yep. Oh, oh. Back line. Wilson. Back yep. Van yep. and Bosch. Hard. Kerr's Hard. calling line. Oh, oh. Keep going. Keep going. Can't hurt it. Can't hurt it. Clean, clean, clean. Can't clean. hurt it, boys. Clean. Take it all the way in. And that'll stop the bleeding. Manitoba will get one here in eight. A little bit of relief for the skip from the Deer Lodge in Winnipeg. Matthew McConaughey, Woody Harrelson, they star in a new series, True Detective. Tonight at 9 Eastern only on HBO Canada. Contact your TV provider to subscribe. That is the uh, Mersey River that runs from here past Liverpool on one side. The town of Brooklyn is on the other, and that, of course, is the home of the legendary Hank Snow. I'm moving on. Right I've been everywhere, man. Two. Celebration this summer in a bit. Oh, here in oh, oh, Liverpool in Brooklyn One, for his 100th yeah. birthday. Welcome back as we One, go to two, the eight. ninth. And that point by Manitoba puts them in front again by Good a ride. couple. And here That's in nine, cool. it will be New Brunswick that has the last rock. 
They have the hammer playing the red Same stones. Way. I picked on Braden a little bit, Vic, uh, by uh, you know a couple overthrows, and we talked earlier that he, he wouldn't be sure how straight the ice would be because he'd been off for a while, and it was a hair straighter. Definitely caught him, but that was that was a character builder there to make that one. That was a massive shot to Stop go two 12, up. Guys. Where? Line's good. Tight. Go hard then. Top 12, guys. Just biting. Whoa. Stay top 12. Fine only. Just go at the end. It's in. Yeah, that's good. Clean it. Something we point out oh. in all our coverage. Perfect. Boy. That guard. That's awesome. Nice. Covering the edge of the eight, maybe yeah. over just a little too far. You bring it back, and as you just, say, now you can go both ways. Yeah, exactly. No question about it. But you don't want it too close to the center line either, which would stop that potential path of the outturn draw to the button. So it's not too bad, but you're right. It would be difficult to get around it on the uh, left-hand side. Hack. Hack. Good oh. hack. It's good hack. Close. Yep. Great call here. So many young teams want whoa, to play the whoa. easy double. When you're playing whoa. a double, you throw a lot of weight, yeah, you yeah. hit it in the wrong spot, you roll out. Hard. Manitoba rips the guard off, and you cannot score two points. So look at that weight. Who cares where the yellow ones go? Hang around. Yeah. Well, when you go back to that uh, Troll. steal Troll. of Troll. one and seven, right? It was yeah. because there were so many rocks in that's, play. Yeah, it, 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 absolutely. No, it's fine. Oh, okay. no, you got it. Control. Control. Yep. Hard. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Right off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no. Okay. Girl. My fault. Another uh, rock missed on the high side. That's been a pattern here. And they might be getting fooled by New Brunswick a little bit with the softer releases. They're take, taking a lot of ice for some of these shots. Six. Line's good. Six, seven. Yeah. Line only. Hey. Line, Line only. Hey. Wait's there. Okay, whoa, whoa then. Yeah, hey. yeah, yeah. Hey. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Well, Lucas Vanden Bosch, who throws the seconds for this Manitoba Championship team, part of the uh, first team All-Star, Carter Lautner out of Glencoe and Calgary, lost earlier today in the semifinal. He was the All-Star first team skip. I go ahead and go here. Feel. What do you like? You almost run the guard. You do that. If I throw it hard enough, what? worst case, we peel it. Just peel it off? And hopefully get the back one. Or yeah. try and run it. Actually, I don't think it's there. Kit. I think it sticks if I make it. Straight peel is fine. Even if I catch it, I'll just play on the Straight peel? Corner. Yeah. You got it. You got it. Good call again. You could uh, take the bait and draw around, sit two, but if something goes wrong, that back red one could go on the scoreboard. Yep. Peeling this guard, Manitoba's not going to get up a big end. That. There are your uh, second team All-Stars, and take a note of uh, David Ajo, who threw the second stones for Alberta. An eighth appearance at the uh, Canadian Juniors, and three different regions. Gotta go hard! Northwest Territories hard! for six, the Yukon hard! seven, really and now Alberta, hard! an eighth appearance, and he ages out now at the age of 20. Go peel. For a third, eh? Yeah. It's early enough, early enough in the end here. You could actually hit this and roll towards Are the red one. Third we'll pick for an arrow to the we'll opponent. They're yeah. going to try the double yeah, here. If you miss the double, the uh, the next double could be harder.
Peel. Yep. Yep. Hard. Whoa. Yes. Yep. Whoa. Kyle Kurz. Angle it back. Oh, go, 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 go. and enough. A oh, big shot. Looked like it was going to be a big jam, but it spilled off. Boy, he's made a couple of. He made that earlier run back to get rid of three stones. Nearly got four. Yeah. The big weight ability, the lots of rotation. When this hits, look at it spin. When these lively striking bands. The yellow one's gone for fun. Looked like you say it was going to jam, but rolls out easy. Oh, that ability too. Uh, we we've marveled. Back twelve tons of room. Brad Watch Jacobs me. and his team have done. Canadian Lord, champion hey going to be in Sochi wearing the Maple Leaf. Way out there. That ability. Where? We're there. To run Oops, stones girl. back. Yeah. And I think at the Continental Cup just last weekend when he was playing Norway's Thomas Olsrud, sent a message. Thomas and oh, anyone else who I plays this. Nothing safe. Oh, so true. I was talking to the Northern Ontario uh, coach for the uh, boys team that when we first got there, Vic, and he said that the uh, they play at the same spot Ryan Fry and uh, Brad Jacobs do, and they they sometimes practice runbacks when the rock isn't even close to the hog line. They put the the rock 10, 15 feet short of the hog line and yep. run it back that extra distance just for just for practice to be that much more accurate. Oh, it is a weapon, oh. and that that could be a game-winning shot here for for oh, Kyle because the uh, two-ender is uh, probably not going to happen here. Do you mm. Decision time here, is it? Mm -hmm. What do you do? Do you still go do for it? You want to go for the blank or? Yeah. Try and freeze. I think we freeze. I like the freeze. Do you like the, the freeze? Yeah, I do. In fact, I, I think I, it, it, the, you have to weigh the probability of it not being made. That's all. If if this rock like over curls, then Manitoba can sit two, and then you might not have the chance to blank. But uh, you you've got a great player here, like Danielle, and he can lock this on, and, and the, the oh, blank is still think. available. Plus, you have a chance to get Locked an error here and score your deuce. Wait, wait only. Rip. Line's good. Move, can't switch. Where? Line's there. perfect. No, there. it's got to curl still. Got to curl. Yeah, it's gonna curl a bit. Curl. Oh, this is a beauty. Whoa, 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 whoa. Curl, 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 curl. Oh goodness. Oh God. You know, we talk often how difficult they are. Strategy you have to take in who's throwing the rock, and if if it's a it's a club team, you probably don't play that shot in that situation because if the freeze isn't made well enough. You could be forced to a single, but not when uh, what kind of Danielle can throw them Heel. like that. What a okay. great freeze. You got it. Now the blank is definitely available, and who knows? If this rock's not made, you get your deuce. Well, Braden Calvert, his first skip yep. stones oh. in the ninth. Yep. Yes, clean, clean. Atta boy. Great throw. That's good stuff. Nice I mean, throw. I don't even know where could you have put that stone to be safe? Right on the beat and glued? Yeah, that would be all. You'd have to, that had to bend another inch and be frozen solid. And then, even then, it might go out. Nice shot. Hit it in the perfect spot, too. So, what do you think for back 12? 90. 90? That one's not in, so yeah. there's really no risk. Well, the freeze becomes extremely tough because you want it close if you move that yellow at all to the play. Mine's good. Wait only. Wait only, guys. You can wait. It's got to move. That looks deep. We're back. We're wow. to it. We're this might be a takeout. You look like you're bumping. Uh, no, we're, at the, we're good. We're it's good. Just to it. Line's perfect. Line's perfect. Can't bump. Can't bump. Can't bump. Sit down. Good. Uh, that bus gone. 
great try, but it just had no room for air at all. Must have just tapped just it out. Tossed it like an inch. Control. Yeah. Okay, you got it. Well, that's that's where you gave it for me, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, it w if, if, it had, that, yeah. if it had the right weight, though, it would have overcurled. So. Well, I threw it an inch heavy. I mean. Brandon Bosch and Wilson all the way down, and look at that, they'll hang it on the back of the 12-foot. So come and get me. Rene Cole. Let's peel it out. Yep. Clean. Clean. Whoa, whoa. Final clean. stone. Clean. clean. Looking for the blank. Just clean. Just clean. And he'll get it. So New Brunswick. We'll take the last rock to 10. They'll need two to tie. It's the men's final, Canadian Juniors. It's now time for today's secret word. The secret word is M&M. Go to finalend.ca and enter this word for your chance to win. So here we go. Manitoba leads by two. New Brunswick, however, does have the last rock hey, playing the Red yeah, Stones oh, at the M&M. Oh. Meat Chops Canadian Juniors. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I have to hate to see that. You're cleaning that, too. Okay. Normal? Yeah. No, you don't see this in a club game very often, but what a wonderful call this is. Yeah. We talked about it in the break, you and I, Vic, about two ups, an interesting situation, because you know there's going to be a corner guard, and you, if you play it out, you give up a two, so yeah. you, you counter by putting one in the rings. Now that there's no corner guard, change that strategy, flip it around. The only rock that can hurt you at this point is the one on the button. Get rid of it. Just enough. Boy, that was one... Big, deep, held breath Clean by everything. Brendan Wilson. And now he can breathe. Good. Two. Mine's good. Clean it. Would it be unheard of if you're the team two up just to pitch them to the bumpers? Yeah, I've seen it. I've seen that, Vic. Or is it it's still too early? Because you, uh, well, now, now, obviously, yeah. without the guard, you just run up and rip this now. Right. But, but you're right, Vic. I've seen teams do that. By you, you put the two yellows in to draw the plate to the middle, but at some point in time, we talked about it earlier when there was a steal in the um, fourth or fifth end that too many yellows in play can be detrimental. So what a massive advantage after that uh, pick to just to run everything out of there. And, Make six rocks go away and you win here. Got it. Peace. Oh. oh. And just. Everything's a little anxious now. Manitoba sensing. Keep up the corner. That Canadian championship is just so, so close now. And we've all been there where that adrenaline, you're sitting in the hack as a second stone, as a third, or then eventually the skip saying, if I can just make a hit and roll out, yeah. you want to throw it harder it's in case there. you hit it all thick. There. That's, there. that's the that. tendency. Three. You know you're going to hit the Three. object rock, in this case Three. a red one. If you hit it really Three. thick, Three. your brain says, well, let's throw it harder because I'll have a better chance of rolling okay, out. And that's how you make the errors. 
Put the broom in the right spot. Throw the controlled peel weight. Nice get that there. thing out of there. You got it. Yep. Hard. Hard, guys. Clean. Yeah, hard. Clean. Clean. Good. Manitoba leaves by two as we play in ten. And the game story? Well, that four really sticks out in a tough break for uh, New Brunswick and uh, Rennie Como just a little soft on his release there. Five-point swing. It's hard to come back from that, but they did until the eighth end. And what a wonderful come around tap for uh, Braden Calvert that uh, when they were leaking a bit of oil, Vic, made a nice come around tap to take that two-point lead into nine, Great. and that's been the difference. The game story brought to you by m, &M Meat Shops. Frozen food at its oh, best. Yeah. And hey, keep going back to this same corner here. Would you Good. move it around a bit? Definitely move it around a little bit. So. Most teams like the outturn peel, so they are forcing Manitoba to the intern. But uh, this Cowboy, a player with the leg drive these young men have, the lots of rotation, the type of rocks they're using, it's pretty easy to make these peels. That's exactly where they want to hit it, taking zero ice here. Kyle Kurz. Hard clean. Recording it all. The winner, of course, will go on to Flims, Switzerland. They'll join Kelsey Rock and her team oh, from Edmonton Where? as the great. Canadian representatives at the World Juniors. Just clean to clean. Obviously, uh, disappointment too for Michelle and Randy Como. Yep, yep, yep. Hard. One mistake. Oh, oh, clean. And it was oh, a big clean. one. Clean. Oh, oh. First pick all week. I know. Second. The boys talking. It's the first pick they've noticed all week. And extremely bad timing. Mine's good. I'm going to go to the Two, center three. line this time. Give another different Switch. look for the skipper. Two, three. Try to get the center line. Get the finish. Yeah. Yeah. Keep her going, keep her going. Good. This is the key when he Clean makes it, this go away. Mm -hmm. Keep the brooms down. Yeah. You got it. No. Yep, yep. Boy. Hard. Pitch it a bit. Hard. Clean. Trying Clean. to hold this. Clean. And well done. And now you need the, uh, the complete miss. Rene Como. He underthrew it, so. Yeah, I got it. Try to get it, like, yeah. way out here. As close to it as possible. 
I like that thought process. This is a gamble because it's, it's, it's difficult to hit the rings when you're aiming at a corner. But desperate times. Trying to give a different look to Braden for his last one. Just to try to get it way out there on his own turn. What do you think? Uh, four still? Yeah, four. Yeah. Mine's good. Mine's really good. Wait on Seven, me. guys. Seven. Inside out, it's always pretty quick. The brushers have Seven. to be careful here. Seven. Right here. Curling a lot. Whoa, if you can't. Make sure we're seven. If we're not seven, we're not, we're not in. Yep. Whoa. Once it's in. Once it's in, off. Okay. Well done. Rene Como hangs it on the edge. That's a brilliant shot. Matt Dunstone, a year ago, Manitoba, one stone away from making it back-to-back -back wins in the Canadian Juniors. <laughs> Kyle Kurz almost swept it all the way down to the hat, <laughs> taking no chances. Gathering himself up. Final stone. Clean. Clean. Braden yep. Calvert, Clean. Clean. the former Manitoba Clean. high school champion. Wow. Final rock, and he is now Canadian champion. Mom Joanne and Dad Grant. Make the final. 7-5, Manitoba. And now it's on to Switzerland and to wear the maple leaf at the World Juniors. Congratulations to Rene Como. We'll remember that one mistake and that comeback that falls just a little short. Tommy! Oh, way to go, way to go. Big ol'. Good job, good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Hang in there. The M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors are brought to you by M&M Meat Shops. Frozen food at its best. Make it fast and get back here. M&M Meat Shops Canadian Juniors are brought to you by World Financial Group, creating a better tomorrow for families today. WFG by Ford, proud partner of the Canadian Curling Association for over 20 years. And by Tim Hortons, always fresh, always great tasting coffee. It's a happy uh, great Calvert with his uh, family on hand here in Liverpool as he celebrates a Canadian championship, a second straight for Manitoba. And Brayden, uh, congratulations. It, well, let's go back to the start. You hadn't played in three days. You looked a little shaky as a team coming yeah. out. Yeah, for sure. It, it was a long time uh, finding our groove, and uh, we found it near the end, which, which is good. How much did that miss, the steal of four, change the game, do you think? Oh, I think it changed it dramatically. Uh, without that miss, it's it's probably tight coming home, uh, even tighter than it was. But then you failed to score until the eighth, and you yeah. had to gather yourself up because the team looked a little shaky again in the yeah. middle. Yeah, it was definitely a scrappy win for us, uh, but we'll definitely take it, and we maybe just weren't quite as sharp as we were the rest of the week. Hey, listen, you were uh, good enough to win a Canadian championship. Congratulations, and uh, good luck in Switzerland. And Okay, here's your chance, my friend. You get a chance to do me. Well, let's make the final, Russ. <laughs> Congratulations. All the Thank best you. to you. Thanks, Dick. Congratulations to this team from the Deer Lodge Curling Club in Winnipeg.
And now they get the chance. The chance that every team would hope to be able to do in their career, and that's do the walk of a champion. Congratulations to Braden Calvert, Kyle Coors, Lucas Vandenbosch, Brendan Wilson, and Coach Tom Clasper, who now adds a Canadian Junior Championship to a resume that includes a CIS gold medal a year ago, and of course that Scotty's win with Connie Laliberti back in 1995. And they, of course, will go on to Switzerland and join the Alberta team of Kelsey Rock as representatives at the World Juniors. He admitted, Russ, that, you know, it was just a, just a little shaky at times, but good enough, and the good teams do that all the time. We they gather like themselves up. Mr. Exactly, to, to make that great shot in the eighth, and when they were leaking a bit of oil, showed a lot of character. m and Meat Shops to present the medals to the bronze medal team from Alberta, while Shirley Osborne, CCA board liaison to the 2014 m and Meat Shops Juniors, presents Keeper Awards. Jim Lautner is the coach of this Alberta team. Coach Jim Lautner, lead Kyle Morrison. Out of Second, the Glencoe Club in David Calgary. Uh, there's Third, Dave Ajo has Taylor mentioned Ardell. eight times at the Canadian Juniors. That's a record of three different representatives. Taylor Ardell and uh, Carter Lautner, who was the first team Mr. Mitchell will now present medals skip. to the silver medal team from New Brunswick. While Greg Thorburn, the host committee chair, will present keeper awards for Team New Brunswick. Well, you're from New Brunswick. What do you think of this team from the Capital Winter Club? And uh, in particular, that gentleman right in front, uh, Damian Layton, who coached this team and came on just a mere couple of months back. A real Cinderella story, wasn't it? He just came out of nowhere to coach the team. And uh, what a great team put together at the last minute. And uh, they, they really did New Brunswick proud. Uh, Damian Layton. On the paper, on the, on the percentage side, they actually curled Manitoba in that game. Thank you. Ryan, Ryan Freeze. Ryan Freeze. Jordan Kraft at second. As mentioned, they'd been together second, since the Jordan age of Kraft. 12. The newcomer, Daniel Wenzek, makes the trip east from Third, Burnaby. Daniel Wenzek. And then the skip Rene Como. And skip Rene Como. Mr. Mitchell will now present the gold medals to the champions from the province of Manitoba, while Hugh Avery, CCA board chair, presents the Keeper Awards. For Team Manitoba, Coach Tom Clasper. Lead Brendan Wilson. Second, Lucas Vandenbosch. This gentleman here, Third, Kyle, Kyle Kurz. Kurz. I thought he had a couple of big shots. The, and that Skip great double Brent across Calvert. the sheet, double in nine, uh, cost uh, you know the chance to get the deuce and tie the game. That was that could have been the turning point right there. And Skip Braden Calvert, the agricultural student at the uh, University of Manitoba. Lots of pictures. Mr. Mitchell of M&M Meat will now present the m and Championship Trophy to the 2014 Junior Men's Winners from the province of Manitoba. And here they are from the Deer Lodge Curling Club in Winnipeg. Skipped by Braden Calvert. Congratulations and good luck to you and the team as well as Kelsey Rock out of the Savile Community Sports Center in Edmonton when you wear the Maple Leaf at the World Juniors in Flim, Switzerland beginning February the 26th. Well, was hang snow from right here that said I've been everywhere man and we're moving on <laughs> we're moving on to Montreal next Saturday our coverage of the Scotties begins and we'll see Andrea Crawford from New Brunswick as she opens against Allison Ross of Quebec making a second straight appearance representing and out of the city of Montreal what a weekend it's been here in Liverpool, our thanks to everyone. We have had a wonderful time. Thank you, Liverpool, for all that you've done. Now on behalf of Russ and our entire crew, thank you for joining us. The m and Meat Shops Canadian Juniors are here on Canada's sports leader, TSN.